The name of the game by Emily Lynn Shepard follows Jane Doe, a talented marketing executive who moves to New York City seeking a fresh start after the death of her grandmother. Chapter 1 The Beginning Jane Doe, a talented but disillusioned marketing executive, grapples with the recent death of her beloved grandmother. The loss leaves her questioning her purpose and priorities. Jane is introduced as a highly successful yet emotionally isolated individual struggling to find meaning in her high-pressure career. This chapter sets the stage for Jane's journey of self-discovery and transformation. Chapter 2, New Beginnings Seeking a Fresh Start, Jane relocates to New York City to accept a challenging position at a prestigious marketing firm. She is determined to reinvent herself and leave behind the shadows of her past. At work, she meets Mark Thompson, a seasoned professional who becomes both a mentor and a source of conflict. Jane also encounters Alex Carter, a charming and enigmatic colleague, sparking a complex and intriguing connection. This chapter delves into the excitement and anxiety of new beginnings and the initial steps towards forging new relationships. Chapter 3, Unexpected Challenges Settling into the new job proves more difficult than anticipated. Jane is assigned to a high-stakes project critical to the company's future. She faces intense pressure from her boss, Susan Miller, and skepticism from some colleagues. As Jane navigates these professional hurdles, she struggles with self-doubt and imposter syndrome. Meanwhile, her relationship with Alex begins to deepen, but the boundaries between personal and professional life blur leading to moments of awkwardness and tension. Chapter 4, Deepening Connections Jane's bond with Alex grows, marked by shared confidences and mutual support. Flashbacks reveal Alex's backstory, uncovering his own struggles and aspirations. At work, Mark becomes a more complex figure, offering mentorship but also presenting challenges that force Jane to question her values and strategies. This chapter emphasizes the importance of trust and vulnerability in building meaningful relationships. Chapter 5, Crisis Point A critical turning point occurs when the project faces an unforeseen crisis. Key resources are jeopardized, and a competitor threatens to undermine Jane's efforts. The pressure mounts as Jane is forced to make quick strategic decisions to salvage the project. Her leadership and problem-solving skills are put to the test in high-stress situations. Simultaneously, tensions rise with Alex, who becomes indirectly involved in the professional turmoil. This chapter is pivotal, escalating the stakes and deepening Jane's internal and external conflicts. Chapter 6, Revelations Amid the Crisis Jane discovers hidden truths about her colleagues. Secrets about Mark and Alex come to light, revealing personal and professional agendas that shake Jane's trust. These revelations force Jane to reassess her relationships and strategies. She confronts feelings of betrayal and the challenge of navigating a landscape where allies and adversaries are not easily distinguished. This chapter explores themes of deception, loyalty, and the complexities of human relationships. Chapter 7 the turning point. With newfound insights, Jane takes bold actions to turn the project around. She innovates solutions and rallies her team, demonstrating resilience and ingenuity. This process involves difficult conversations and strategic maneuvers to outsmart competitors and win over skeptics within the company. On the personal front, Jane and Alex have a candid, emotional discussion about their past and future confronting the issues that have strained their relationship. Jane's growth becomes evident as she embraces a more authentic and assertive version of herself. Chapter 8, Resolution The climax sees the successful completion of the project, earning Jane acclaim and a sense of accomplishment. She receives praise from Susan and recognition from peers, validating her hard work and perseverance. Jane's relationship with Alex reaches a new level of understanding and commitment characterized by honesty and mutual support. This chapter wraps up the main conflicts, showcasing Jane's triumphs and the solidification of key relationships. Chapter 9, New Horizons Reflecting on her journey, Jane evaluates the personal and professional growth she has undergone. She considers new opportunities and decides to take on a role that aligns more closely with her values and aspirations. Jane's evolution is underscored by her newfound confidence and clarity about what she wants in life. This chapter provides a sense of closure while suggesting that Jane's journey of self-discovery and growth is ongoing. Chapter 10, The Name of the Game 
The final chapter ties together the novel's themes, emphasizing Jane's understanding of what truly matters at the A name of the game. Jane realizes that success is not solely about professional achievements but also about personal integrity, meaningful relationships, and inner fulfillment. She emerges stronger and wiser, ready to face future challenges with resilience and a clearer sense of purpose. The story concludes on a hopeful note, with Jane embracing the possibilities that lie ahead. If you enjoyed this summary and want to see more, Please like this video and subscribe to our channel. Don't forget to share your thoughts on the book in the comments, and we'll see you in the next video.